Hi friends, welcome to Samurai Bot tutorial. Today we want to create business website, both front end and back end of it. Uh, we don't have this app before you can quickly install it from Play Store. We have Samurai Bot. Then after installation, you can check the second option, which is free website builder. Now, after you've created your website with this app, you will have two links, one for your website and the other one for the website manager. Now, on getting to the website manager, go straight to settings. Scroll down, you see your manager ID. It's either you use the app to manage your website or you use your PC. But I'm going to use the PC now. So go to settings, scroll down, you see your manager ID. That's what you use to log into the PC manager ID. Now, after you've copied your ID, go to manager.service.com, then paste your ID. So it will take me to the uh, to my website manager. Now here is my website manager, and uh, here is my website. The website I've created is this. And uh, let me refresh this page again. This is my website. All these uh, pictures, you go to the website manager to edit them. Okay. So as you can see, so if you scroll down, there's nothing like register here. So go to your panel. So click on admin panel here. Now it takes me to this place. You can see user sign up. So enable. Now select portal you want to enable. So is where uh, is business website I want. So click on this and update. Good. You can see where it takes me to. Now that means I can check my clients, people that have registered to my website, the code they sent, um, the project we have started. Like for example, let me. You know there is nothing here. Let me refresh this website. And I will register. I have an account before. Let me log in. So login. Now you can see I can request codes and the project we have started. So I can check my profile. On display, you can see it updates your profile. Now let me send the codes. Maybe I want a particular uh, service immediately and uh, i want you to deliver a logo for me so just type anything here you as a as a client you send it a sent now as an administrator you will check on that code so the one i just sent is here so you can just check the person that sent it. you can see the details i can check the person that sent it here and uh, this is the person that sent it. I want to start a project with the person. You click on this icon. You can see. So create a project for this person. So the name of your project, blah blah blah, and all that. Okay, you can check messages because they are from here. User can send message and they can view the project you have created. So if you create a project, they can you can they can track the project, the process of the project. This is the project I just start and there will be your customers let me say your clients will be able to see it from here under my project so from here you can see this one is started you can see it started i can you are an administrator you can edit this project to maybe completed and your your client will be able to see it you can see it's completed Another thing they can send message, they can go to your website and others. And from here, you as an administrator, you can see you can try their messages. And uh, on the, the method of uh, online store, it's still the same way. But the only thing is during your process on adding it here, so instead of you to select business website you choose online store so let me choose online store 
and here you see that the menu will change all the menus available for me will change even include the menu here on user this is user now if you check here you can see it has changed because on this platform has changed its settings to online store so anything relating to online store will be displayed on the menu you can see we have go shopping so it's only three products i have here so i can go shopping i can buy from here i can buy or i go straight to the person's website this is the person's website and i go to the product this is available product buy now you can see where it takes me to click here so my i can order it from here and the administrator will receive email it is placed successfully so if i come to this place i can check new orders so this is the order that it just placed now okay and uh, from here you can see i can check my customer you know before it was client because i changed my settings to online store so that's why this place changed to customers now we have a store setup on your store you want to, you want to collect users address if yes require if no you don't want then the shipping fee the button that will display on home page that's uh, the button is will be called buy now anything like and put there then let me save it so it is saved and on that displays you can see the order i've placed so you as an administrator maybe you want to edit the order Under the orders, you can change the status of the orders. Maybe it is processing, it is uh, delivered, like here, you can see. Maybe you have delivered the order, you can select delivered. So your your customer will be able to see, they will be able to track the order. It is placed here. So if I, let me refresh here, because it is delivered. Because I, I changed it from this place. Another thing, messages so your customer can send you a message and they enter your email as well as here you able to find those messages here all right now let's move on to other portal go to admin settings you can see we have different websites here so any you want to be active on your website thanks for watching